So northern leopard frogs are considered um, threatened within Alberta. And at the Centre for Conservation Research at the Calgary Zoo, we work on endangered and species at risk. There's actually not very much information known about the frog, so it was just a great opportunity to get your hands dirty and to get in there and find out some, something about an Alberta species that we all know and love. Brianna and her research partner Natalie really do get their hands dirty as they travel the back roads of southern Alberta and search areas of known habitat. On a typical day counting leopard frogs south of the Cypress Hills, they spend hours sloshing around shorelines and braving strong cold winds to collect their valuable data. Uh, working in wetlands, you're going to take a dive, it's going to get wet or it'll be raining, so yeah, they are. Um, on waterproof paper, which protects the data. Northern leopard frogs live in a variety of habitat, but come springtime, they prefer shorelines with vegetation growing in the water, places where they can lay their eggs, find something to eat, and be relatively safe. During their breeding season, they prefer stiller water with some vegetation for them to attach their egg masses to. If they can find a place that doesn't have fish in them, because um, fish do predate on northern leopard frog eggs. They eat um, lots of insects and algae, I'm sure. And Last year I saw um, a group of pelicans, which are so beautiful when they fly in, and I was looking at all these metamorphs in the pond there, and this pelican just swooped down with his mouth open and just scoop, and I was like, ah. So that's why uh, frogs, they definitely overproduce. They do know that the, it's a numbers game that the frogs play. Northern leopard frogs um, seem to be declining in Western Canada and the Western United States, um, whereas in the eastern populations of northern leopard frogs, they seem to be quite stable. So why they're declining in Western Canada and Western states, we don't know. So, yeah, we're going to try and find out the rate of decline and then try and determine, obviously, how to halt the decline and why they are, in fact, declining. Like gold, leopard frogs in Alberta are where you find them. But for some still unknown reason, they've vanished from a lot of their former Western Canada range. Brianna's love for the Alberta landscape and her obvious affection for leopard frogs may help solve the mystery. Well, first of all, I love being outdoors and Alberta is such a beautiful place. It really gives you the opportunity to explore. And leopard frogs, I like their spots and just their call. It sounds like a sounds like an actual leopard, which is probably, with the spots, it's probably how they got their name as well. But just that call, and they're just, yeah, they're just so fun to watch swimming around. You can't have a bad day when you see a frog. 